basically you must be so we talk about competence having those three basically what comes to your mind is business awareness uh, economic um, knowledge and uh, financial knowledge uh, you must be able to analyze the, the company's financial statement where we are not seeing uh, where your contribution as a as a unit as a department as an organization could you know that that was a part of the organization uh, one of the things I used to do in the past
start asking questions. So if you work in the public sector, what differentiates the expectation from the public sector to come out of my industry as well as the private sector? What's the difference? What kind of competences uh, differentiate the roles that you require to, to play in both judicial?
wise head. The plane they were about to land, then the visiting torch they turned around to switch, and the plane decided to go up rather than go down. And they started fighting the plane. They had come down and pushed the plane down. The plane refused to come down. They crashed everybody. Everybody died, including themselves. But when they moved to the body, it was found out that the old model aircraft immediately used to push when they have such an the aircraft were as hard as well as the system plays the aircraft. The aircraft, the program, they really touch that force to take you off the photo and take it. And how everything plays with this man, it could be crashed with this same thing. If you don't understand that you're moving from an hotel, so you're moving from a residential or an office to an hospital, and require different sets of skills, competence, and understanding, and requirements of
we need assessment for this analysis. What will be required? What will be required? What material? What kind of material? And it's also to propose bags on the stand of the data. So the Commissioner said we we'll want to achieve. So let's go back to the terminal. The terminal currently runs by this passenger that is in minutes per passenger. That's what analysis is. But the objective is to reduce it to 8 minutes. And we have a role to play in that. And part of the role is that we want to expand the uh, passenger processing. Area where the number of passengers can be processed will increase rather than reduce, and also increase the number of people that will be working to process the passengers. So you must understand so what do you require? So there is now a need. What do you need to put in place? You need to put in place a standard of technician to be allowed to ensure that things work every time. You need flexible for the scanner and baggage and whatever. You have a team that's Thank you. 
responsible for maintaining them. Uh, these are part of the to define. Uh, these are things that cannot be done in the wind, in an emergency. Without. So planning is, is key to sourcing. You cannot talk about sourcing without planning. Uh, planning is your number one step uh, before you get to sourcing. Any questions? We will stop here today. Uh, I'll just take questions for another five minutes. Unless there is any. And, um, from sourcing, let's start. Hello? Yes, Felicia. Um, I know that you are talking about um, by that raise the order and all. But what about what about if you're in a country where this um, level is not all the equipment, this all the equipment, what is going to do, and how many years it will last? And at the end of the week, it's still not so active. That's my own um, office. Um, in a country, you know them who I need to be. What is going to do? How many years it will last? Um, uh, functionality and everything, then you have to take how much you want. Then go to the center and get the right side of that quality. Then go ask. Yes. You're, not supposed to, you're not supposed to be the one going to the vendor. So I tried the experience. When I was in Mr. B's, um, we had the procurement department of mostly buying foods related items. So my team has always complained that every time we ask them to, to buy things, they don't get the right spec. So I decided that, yeah, why not? We can give procurement to one of our team members. I'm taking a technical buyer. I have to create that in the department. I created a technical buyer in the department. Send one of my technical team members who are doing procurement. I have all our procurement responsibilities. I'm sitting in procurement. Today's guys are still in procurement today, they are thinking in the procurement after that system. We are going is that you need to see because you can't make the system work. Like the same thing has never been shown. Before I got there, Each 
Thank you. 